story of Spectra by Evan Blades. I just gotta say that it was... awesome! Wasn't that song about Rainbow Factory and the Pegasus device? And the fact he asked us to do this ad when we were the main characters in the story? And how right you are, Scootaloo! But let me explain. 1. This isn't an ad, it's a promotion. 2. It's inspired by both songs. And 3. He hired us since we aren't the main characters. How is it inspired by the other songs? And why did he decide to make this song when Rainbow Factory was made like almost half a decade ago? I'm satisfied with my questions. No more to ask for now. Well, his song takes place 11 years after the Rainbow Factory was opened. The main characters are Zap Bolt is OC, his friends with unknown names, and an unknown scientist. The whole video is in the form of a campfire story, where Zap Bolt is telling the story. And even though I said we aren't characters, we actually get a cameo. Now I want to listen to it. How do I find it? I know how to find it. I didn't know he hired you too. <laughs> Listen to it! Go to YouTube and search Story of Spectra by Evan Blaze! And that's basically it! You know what's kind of funny? His last video before this one! Cut! Scootaloo, please stick to the script that was not in the script. Let me see. What is this? It's nothing. Honestly, I thought this would have been a one-take thing without fourth wall breaks until Scootaloo had to ruin her life. What in the name of Lauren Faust is this? Oh, um, it's a meme. You see, unexplained, uh... Would you look at the time? Gotta go! Get back here right now! <laughs> Does this mean we can leave? What's going on, guys? It's Seven Plays here. And no, I did not get beaten up by Rainbow Dash. It was just a comedy skit to promote my song, Story of Spectra. It was heavily inspired by Rainbow Factory and Pegasus Device. So I want to give a shout out to Sylph, Storm, Wooden Toaster, and Brony Dance Party for giving me the inspiration to make this happen. Now it's time for credit shoutouts. Usually whenever I'm using audio or video or whatever, I have to give credit to somebody or else my videos will get taken down for copyright. Shout out to Scott Joplin for The Entertainer. I had to pitch it down a bit or yeah i pitched it down next shout out will go to alan Silvestri for portals from avengers endgame like i said i had to pitch it down a bit next shout out kevin mcleod for making a rearrangement of edward Griggs in the hall of the mountain king he's a uh, royalty free music composer or non-copyright whatever Next shout out goes to another royalty free. Uh, it's uh, the whistling song in the beginning, I think. And uh, I don't know why I should give it royalty free to that. But that's all the shout outs for credit. Oh, one more important shout out goes to 15.ai for the amazing AI text to speech for the characters for My Little Pony. And shout out goes to Lauren Faust and Hasbro for creating the uh, My Little Pony thing. Copyright infringement, copyright strikes, whatever shall I do? Just change the pitch to my audio. That's basically what I do. It's not considered copyright strike, but it's still uh, something just to bypass the copyright rules just to follow them in to be uh, specific one more thing if i tend to stutter a little or like pause or just say uh or just the word or i explained it on my video on youtube titled forget 50 subs voice reveal starts now so that's all also like I said, I can't wait to see you guys listening to my song around Halloween, so just keep a good lookout for that. It's literally going to be on Halloween day, night, whatever. And yeah, that's about it. Uh, be sure to subscribe, like, share this to your friends. And a shout out goes to me. I shouldn't be giving myself shout out for credit since it's my creations but 
the music that's playing right now goes by the following one of my creations called Pandemic Cure. Another one of my <clears throat> songs I made was the instrumental cover of uh, a remix of Chug Jug With You by Rock Norden. This third one I uh, made myself. It's the Gangsta's Paradise by Coolio. I should give a shout out to him for inspirational things. But what this is, it's if it was a horror movie trailer. Just to give you a Halloween-ish type mood. For the Rock Norden remix, I will give a shout out to Rock Norden as well. So, credit goes to him. I made an instrumental version. If I can get my subscriber count to 1,000 subscribers before my 20th birthday, which is April 14th, 2024, I will upload the instrumental of Rockin' Orden's Chug Jug Remix. And, uh, yeah, that's it. Make sure to, uh, follow my other social medias. See you on Halloween. <laughs>